Assalamualaikum everyone. How are you? I hope all of you is in a pink health. So today, as you can see, we are going to learn about materials. We're going to learn where clothes comes from. Let's see. At the end of this lesson, pupils will be able to first know words such as cotton, leather, and wool. And second, pupils will be able to know where clothes comes from. We have a few vocabularies to learn. The first one, cotton. Cotton, kapas. Plants, plants. Tumbuhan. Leather. Leather, kulit. Cow, cow. Lembu. Wool, wool. Bulu. Ship, ship. Biri biri. Okay, so for number one, can you see what picture is this? Yes, correct. This is. A plant that produces cotton. So let's see. Cotton comes from plants. You can wear cotton short and t-shirts. Okay, shorts and t-shirt. Number two, leather comes from cow. You can wear leather shoes. And jackets, kulit datang daripada lembu. Number three, wool comes from sheep. Bulu dari, datang daripada biri-biri. You can wear woolen sweaters and socks. So now we have come to our first activity: look and match. Based on what we have learned just now, so let match now. For the first picture, let let us do it together. For the first picture, this is a picture of cotton. Okay, a plant. So plant is cotton. What are the clothes that is made from cotton? Yes, very good. Cotton short. Second, what is it? Cotton T-shirt. Next, we have cow. Leather comes from cow. What are the clothes that are made from that were made from leather? Very good. Jacket. And one more. Shoes. And last but not least, we have sheep. Sheep. Wool comes from sheep. What are the clothes? That were made from wool. Sweater, and last but not least, socks. For activity two, say the material for clothes. For example, picture one is wool. What is this? This is a wool hat. So now we can guess what is. Um, so we can see what is number two, three, four, five, and six. Let's go. For number two, this is a belt. Belt is made from. Dipebuat daripada apa? Belt. Adakah dipebuat daripada kapas? Cotton. No. Adakah dipebuat daripada bulu? Wool. No. It is made from leather. Kulit. So, picture two is. Leather. Picture three. This is a hat. Okay. Hat made from cotton or wool or leather. That's very good. Picture three is cotton. Dipebuat daripada kapas. Number four. Apron. Apron. Apron biasa mak kita guna di dapur, betul tak? 
Okay, so what do you think um, the material is? Uh, is it wool? Is it cotton? Or is it leather? Very good. Picture 4 is cotton. Picture 4 is cotton. Number 5. Wow, very beautiful shoes. So, as you can see shoes. Is shoes made from wool? Is it made from cotton? Or is it made from leather? Very good. Picture 5 is leather. Kasut dia buat daripada kulit. Shoes are made from leather. So, picture 5 is leather. 6. What is this? This is gloves. Gloves. Okay, gloves keep us warm. So, what is this made from? Is it from wool? Is it from cotton? Or is it from leather? It is made from wool. So, picture 6 is wool. Picture 6 is wool. Okay, so now we have come to our practice. Let us have a practice. Practice 1. You have to take out your English module and turn to this page. Okay? Read the passage and write the correct answer. Okay, so you have to read first. Let us read together materials. Cotton comes from plants. You can wear cotton short and t-shirts. You can wear leather shoes and jackets. Wool come from sheep. You can wear woolen sweaters and socks. Okay, so what you have got to do, you can see the picture, right? There is a picture here. This is a, a sheep. Then we have plants and then we have cows. So let us read again. Cotton. Okay, cotton comes from plant. You can wear cotton short. And T-shirt. Okay, so look at cotton. Cotton. What you have to do is you write short and also T-shirt. And number two, there's actually a sentence here. It's okay, let, uh, let me tell you. Leather comes from cow. So you can wear leather. Leather what? Leather shoes and Jacket, leather, leather shoes and jacket. Which is, which one is leather? Ah, uh, this one. So you find, uh, shoes and jacket. Okay, and next you have to write the correct materials. Okay, we have already say earlier. So picture one is, is what? Picture one is cotton. Very good. And then you do number two, number three, number four, number six, number five, and number six. Right? And for practice two, for practice two, you have to take out your Superminds workbook and turn to page 90. Okay. What you have to do, number one, write the word cotton, wool, or leather. Cotton wool or leather so take a look for the first one for the first one as you can see this is a cloth so it is called cotton for number two what do you think it is it is made from leather very good and then number three what do you think it is okay you have to write down uh, i just gonna guide you miss hanya akan bimbing awak tapi awak kena tulis di ruangan ini so you have to write leather here here okay yang miss garis ni so number three what is it leather two number four what is this this is a sweater okay this is a sweater sweater tadi kita dah belajar sweater made from Wool. Okay. Wool. And this is curtain. Curtain ialah lang, langsir. Langsir diperbuat daripada cotton. Okay. And number six, lastly, we have rug. 
alas kaki. Alas kaki tu, floor mat kita tu, made from, kan dia serap air kan? So, it is made from wool. Okay. Awak jangan buat anak panah macam Miss buat ni. Awak kena tulis di ruangan sini. Okay, tulis jawapan dia apa. Okay. Tengok satu-satu. Tengok daripada Miss terangkan daripada awal tadi. Tengoklah akhir. InsyaAllah awak boleh buat. Okay, number two. Read, then write and draw. I'm wearing a cotton t-shirt, cotton jeans, woolen socks, and leather shoes. Okay. Look at this picture. Um, for example, I am wearing, mesti dia cakap macam ni, a cotton t-shirt. Ah, a cotton t-shirt. Second, dia koma dulu. Dia koma sebab nak cerita banyak kan. Dia koma cotton jeans. Ah, woolen Socks and leather shoes. So what you have to do is, apa yang awak kena buat ialah, you write and draw. Awak perlu tulis, awak perlu tulis versi awak sendiri dekat sini dan kemudian lukis. Make sure you write, I'm wearing a, okay tulislah awak nak tulis apa, wool, a sweater ke woolen sweater a cotton short a cotton skirt faham understand okay so after you do it please send the picture of your module and also supermind workbook to me that's all for today everyone happy learning